I'm Officer Taylor with the Mobile Alabama Police Department. Uh, I've been doing it two or three years now, and, and it's the same old stick, you know, nightly patrols, traffic, and hopefully tonight's going to be quiet. So we'll see what pans out. Dispatch to 401. Go ahead, dispatch. Can you break and roll code 3 to the gas station on east side of Topaz for a robbery in progress? Yeah, for show me 84. 10 4. 4 to dispatch. 402. Um, I'm 1023 on that robbery. Getting this call is kind of convenient. We're right down the road, and it's, it's a robbery in progress, so hopefully nothing bad's happened. Um, maybe the suspect's probably taken off. And... But, you know, hopefully not. Dispatch, show me a 23 on that robbery in progress. Copy that. All right, let's go up here and talk to this other this other officer with the uh, store clerk and see what the officer and the, the clerk has to say about what happened. Go on, officer. Hey, um, well, we had here. I arrived on scene and. I heard this lady over here yelling for help. And so I went up to the store clerk to ask him what happened. And he said there is a male with a little bit to be homeless. Um, put him at knife point and asked him to give him all the money. And then came out here and robbed this female over here with Officer Maddox. All right. Well, um, I'm going to talk to the store clerk and uh, see what he has to say. How's it going, sir? Hello, officer. Well, well, can you tell me what happened? Okay, so the homeless man, he came into the store with a knife, jumped not the counter. No, not true. Sir, we'll no. call you in a second. No, this is not um, true. Can Don't you listen tell to me. He's Sir, a liar. calm down. No. Officer, handle never... him, please. The man is a liar. Okay, so can you tell me, you know, what happened? So he came with a knife, as... jumped the counter. And then, and then grab me a knife point, slam me towards the cash register, telling me to open it. I open it for him, he cuts some slices on my arms, and then throws me down to the ground and runs out towards the lady right. over there. Okay, he uh, went towards the lady, did you see anything happen with that? No, I'm still on the ground trying to get up. Alright. Um, we'll get EMS out here to you and let him check out that arm. What's up, officer? Uh, officer Officer Taylor and I am sitting here talking to this victim, uh, female victim, she says that uh, one male uh, that robbed the store clerk has taken off uh, with her purse um, down Topaz Street. Um, I'm going to uh, let you stay here with them and um, go see if I can uh, find the suspect. Uh, she, said suspect was wearing, she said suspect was wearing green pants and a white top. All right, go on ahead with that. No, I'm going to go talk to her. You'll never find him. Hi there, ma'am. Can you tell me what happened to you? Um, you know, we got the robbery over here, you know, and I heard you got involved in it. What happened? Are you kidding me? This idiot just robbed me. Like, he just came up, he robbed that store clerk over there, then he came to me. And then the other idiot ran down somewhere on Topaz. I, I, listen, this is crazy. This is ridiculous. It's been quite a night already. Like, there are things in my purse that I need. Like, I have a job to do. Yes, ma'am, we understand. Haven't I seen you before, ma'am? I don't know, have you? Didn't I arrest you not too long ago for solicitation? Okay, listen officer, I've turned over a new leaf, I promise you, okay? I don't work those streets anymore, I uh, promise okay. you. Okay, well, um, if you can hang out on scene, we'll get your statement. i um, gonna have EMS come check the other guy out. Uh, do you need anything with EMS? No. Okay, well, uh, they'll be here if you need them. Uh, 401 dispatch. 401. Can you get EMS rolled to this gas station on Topaz for a uh, male with a cut arm? 10-4, I'll be notifying Central as we speak. 10-4.
All right. Um, is there anything else you could tell us, ma'am, that would help us out? Anything? I mean, besides the guy wearing the green pants and the white shirt, uh, he was Caucasian. I, I mean, probably like I don't know, like five eight, five nine, and I mean, I mean that's pretty much all I can tell you. All right. Do you think you could? Uh, you saw like if you saw him. Do you think you could point him out and you know, tell if it's if it's actually him? Yes. Because, um, go ahead. Um, I have oh, to see that suspect. All right, man. He, um, suspect's gonna be here pretty soon. So if you'll uh, walk with me to my car and uh, we'll see if uh he can can peg him as a uh, as a suspect. So uh, we got the suspect coming now, and uh, there he is. We'll see if this lady can give us a a positive that it's him. It's him. Ma'am, is this the guy that hit you? Yes, that's that. I want my purse back, you idiot. Ma'am, I have your purse. Calm down. Don't tell her anything, Johnny. Don't tell her nothing. Fuck you. Be quiet, Johnny. All right. Well, um, thank you, ma'am, and uh. Hopefully you have a safe night and nothing eventful happens for the rest of it. Or if you dispatch, so. I'll be 1061 with that suspect. 10 4. 401 dispatch. I'm going to be calling this uh, scene code 4 and everything's all clear. 10 4. Officer Rivera, I'm with the GTA Mobile, Alabama uh, Police Department. I've been uh, with the department for about five years now. Um, one of my main reasons why I became an, uh, a police officer is because I want to make a difference in my community. Um, so that's why I'm working the night shift where crime is most active. Uh, we get a lot of burglaries out in this area, so we try to show a high presence uh, during the night. So. Let's see what we can get into. Dispatch 311. 311, go ahead. Can you respond to a burglary in progress on Sacramento and Lenny? 10 4, show me responding code 3. 10 4. So it looks like we got a burglary in progress right now uh, over at the motorcycle dealership. Uh, this place has been hit a few times before, so. We were never actually able to catch the suspects. So we're going to try to get there as fast as we can and try to apprehend the suspects. 401 dispatch, show me on scene. 10 4 4 show me 23. Looks like we already got one unit on scene already. So. 105 dispatch. Go ahead, 105. Show me 1023 at the uh, motorcycle dealership. 104105, show me 23. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and kill our lights and sirens because uh, we're in the area. We don't want to spook them. On the ground, on the ground! 311, show me uh, 23. Hey! Hey, hey, hey. Hey, officer, hey. Hey, I just need to get my registration papers, okay? Just get let me get the registration papers. Can I get the registration papers, okay? I need these really badly. Let me see your this hands! Put... Okay, okay, get my hands. Don't shoot. Do not shoot. Walk away from the rack. Okay, 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 okay. There, there, there you go. There you go. You Do not up? shoot. Okay. Don't tase me either. Don't tase moving me up, Moving up, moving up. You moved, you're tased. Okay, I'm not moving. I'm not moving. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put your handcuffs. All right. Okay. Okay. Don't. Not too tight. All right, man. I walk out with me to the car.
All right, guys, if y'all want to question me, y'all can. All right, I was last yep. to show up, so. We'll go see what he was trying to get yeah. into. Yeah. I'm just wondering if it's the same perp. Uh, we've had several hits in the last couple of weeks on this place. Yeah. Hey, right, sir. Uh, so you're being placed under arrest right now for burglary. Um, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be presented to you free charge. Do you understand your rights? Yeah, 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 yeah pigs. All right. So what, what, what? What, what what caused you to break in tonight? He goes rush rush his papers. My mom was like, okay, I lost my copy, but I knew these place this place had a copy, so I came in and tried to get it. But you pigs uh, apparently stopped me, so now I can't get. It. Okay, but do you know? Unless what... you want to do me a good deed and you know, let me like slip. The... Yeah, that, that... let me slip the paper in my pocket. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. So why not? So the reason why you initially broke in is to retrieve your registration. Yeah. Okay. So why didn't you just wait till tomorrow morning, to when they open? Well, why would I wait tomorrow morning? I gotta sell my motorcycle about five minutes, but now I'm being in the back of a police car. Well, do you think that was the right thing to do? Yes, it's necessary. I'm getting ten thousand dollars for my motorcycle. I only pay five, so that's a Five thousand, five thousand dollar discount. That's very necessary. Okay, so a pretty much a trip to jail is necessary to sell your motorcycle that you're not even going to sell now. So. Well, I didn't plan on going to jail, officer. So right now you're being placed under arrest um, for uh, breaking and entering. Um, it wasn't a smart idea, so I suggest you not do that in the future. Okay. Yeah, yeah, but.